What's up guys, I'm back. I'm finally out of the field. I was on the field for a long, long 12 days, but it feels good to finally be back talking with y'all, giving y'all the advice that y'all need to make sure that y'all have an awesome Marine Corps career. So I know in some of my videos, I kind of explain like why I personally joined the Marine Corps and stuff like that, but I don't think I've really just really hit hard on the fact of why I joined the Marine Corps in the first place. Why not go with the Army or the Air Force or the Navy? So in this video, I'm gonna explain why I think that the Marine Corps is kind of like better than the other branches or why that you should really just hone in and join the Marine Corps. So I have, I came up with five reasons of why I believe that the Marine Corps is kind of like, not necessarily, I'm not gonna say the best branch, but you know, reasons of why you should, you know, consider joining the Marine Corps. And the first one is just the challenge in itself. There's a reason why we are the smallest military branch. Um, it's because we're the hardest. It's the hardest one to get into. It's the hardest one, you know, to perform in. Boot camp in itself is the hardest one across the board. That's why if you decide, you know, to cross deck, which is going from one branch to another. So if you decide after the Marine Corps, after your four years or however long you enlist, that you want to go to another branch, you don't have to go through their boot camp. But let's say somebody in the Army wanted to come to the Marine Corps, they're going to have to go through our boot camp. And that, that says something in itself, the fact that, you know, but a Marine going to another branch not having to do their boot camp or their basic training, it says like, dang, they've already been through enough, so we're not gonna put them through anything more because we know that they can perform because they went through, you know, Marine Corps boot camp. So the challenge in itself is something, you know, to look forward to, something to, you know, be proud of, especially if you accomplish that. And once you accomplish, you know, earning that title of Marine, no one can ever take that away. There's nothing like, you know, walking home, you know, maybe going to church or something in your dress blues and like, you are the center of attention. Like sure, you can see someone at the grocery store, you know, some army guy wearing his you know, uniform, but if a Marine were to step in, you know, that grocery store or something, you know, just came from a, a, like a wedding or a special occasion and had on his dress blues or something, everyone in that grocery store is gonna stop and look and be like, dang, look at that, that's a Marine right there. And you know, it's, it's an honor that you won't understand until you get in that position. It feels great to, you know, earn that title and for people to recognize, you know, that hard work that you put in. So I would definitely say one, that, that first reason is, you know, the challenge in itself. My kind of second reason is the discipline and structure that you get from the Marine Corps. A lot of people, you know, come to me and ask me, hey, I'm going through a hard time at home or I'm doing this, I got this going, I got this going. I don't know what to do with my life or I don't know, you know, which path to take. And the Marine Corps can kind of guide you along with your life. It can set you up. And the discipline that you're going to learn here is, it's like none other. You're, you're going to be... Not necessarily forced, but you're you're going to want to change. You're going to want to you know be a better person. You're going to want to you know have you know more structure in your life and be more organized and all that stuff. And the Marine Corps is going to give that to you because some people just you know need structure in their life, and the Marine Corps is going to provide that for you. Trust me, they're going to tell you almost every day what exactly to do, and you know it's going to give you something. They're going to give you goals to accomplish, and you're going to have to go out and accomplish them. And you know that that discipline they instill into you is going to help you carry out, you know, those tasks you need to accomplish and those goals you need to accomplish. And it's going to further, you know, make you a better person because when you get out of the Marine Corps, if you decide to, it's going to, those skills that you learn there, you're going to be able to take them into life with you. So all that discipline that, you know, was instilled in you, all that structure, you know, the leadership and organization skills, that's all, you're all going to carry that, you know, for the rest of your life on to whatever you decide to do. So that's another big thing for me is the discipline and the structure that the Marine Corps provides you. My next one is the small unit leadership. It's one that I don't think many people really think about. The Army is the biggest branch, you know, our military, you know, has. It's a lot of people go there. You know, Navy's really big, you know, Air Force, like sure, people go to the Air Force like, ah, I really don't wanna work that hard, but I still wanna be in the military. Uh, I think I'm gonna go to the East Route, I'll go to the Air Force. So, you know, people join the National Guard, like, ah, I wanna be in the military, but I kinda wanna stay at home. So, like, here in the Marine Corps, you're gonna be put in, like, positions to where you have to lead people. Like, someone has to step up. There's always gonna be a position that needs to be filled. And here in the Marine Corps, no one's gonna just hold your hand every step of the way. You're gonna have to, you know, be that one to take charge and, you know, command other people. And that's a big thing that I like about the Marine Corps. You're not, you know, always babysitted. I feel like I've heard, you know, from other branches, like, they kinda of feel like they're babysitted. They don't really get to make all the decisions. Well. At one point in time, while you're in the Marine Corps, you're gonna to have to make you know a decision that's gonna impact potentially a lot of people. I know here in the infantry, you know if you have a team leader bill or a squad leader bill, you're responsible for your team or for your squad. So your decisions impact you know 
not only your team or your squad, but it's going to affect, you know, the platoon and maybe even those actions can affect your company and so on and so on. So that's a big thing. You're going to learn leadership. And that's, I think, I believe is one of the key things that, you know, everyone needs to have in their life. Sure, like it's easy, you know, the cliche thing of saying, you know, uh, don't be a follower, you know what I'm saying? Be a leader. Like it, it, as cliche as it is, the Marine Corps is going to instill that into you. They want you to be a leader. They don't want you to follow the crowd. That's why you are different. You're a United States Marine. You're not, you know, some guy in the Army or the Air Force Navy. You're a United States Marine. You are unique by, like, in that by itself. And that's why I love, you know, about the Marine Corps. They're going to they're gonna teach you some things. And leadership is one of the, I'll probably say, the biggest things that the Marine Corps harps on. They want you to be that good mentor, that good coach. They want you, you know, to build up people and teach them. So that's another big thing that I think not – not only is it important in the Marine Corps, but it's going to, you know, like I said, be one of those things that you can carry on out of the Marine Corps. My fourth thing would be the proficiency in the way, you know, in our job. We are hands down across the board. I don't think anyone can come up with like a valid argument for this. We are the best at what we do, especially the infantry. We train day in, day out. I just got out of a 12 day field op, 12 days straight of just straight training, getting better at our jobs, you know, doing company attacks, squad attacks, platoon attacks, you know, getting better at shooting our rifles and just like me personally getting better with the mortar system and all, you know, the things that is included in that, you know, planning attacks, you know, coming up with schemes of maneuver, like all this stuff. And it's a great, great feeling to know that I'm the best of the best. Now, I'm not just saying me, but, you know, my brothers and sisters here with me, we are the best of the best. That's why when, you know, if something ever happens, that's why we are the 911 for the United States. That's why people are going to call upon the Marines. That's why when we go into different countries, people are scared of, of Marines. They hear Marines are coming like, oh, no, 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 I'm good. You know what? Let me put this gun down. You think, I think I might, I might change my mind. Uh, I was just kidding. That's, that's why people fear Marines for a reason, because we're going to come and we're going to accomplish that job. We're not going to give up. We're not going to stop until that end goal is met. And that's what I love about the Marine Corps, the fact of how hard and how many hours you know, we put in day in, day out to be the best. And it feels good to know that I'm part of an organization where we are the best of the best. And my last thing is probably the biggest one that's, that's, that is in the Marine Corps and that's gonna help you get, get you through the Marine Corps, especially in hard times, it's the brotherhood. Uh, and for all the girls and females out there, uh, I say brotherhood because even, you know, it's, it's a sisterhood as well, but we treat you like, you know, part of the boys. But the brotherhood in itself is something that is going to be forever there. The saying of once a Marine, always a Marine is always true. There's nothing, you know, better than, you know, having your boys go through the suck with you and, you know, be in the field with you, getting rained on and getting bit up by bugs and all that stuff. It's nothing like, you know, having your boys there with you, you know, going through the same stuff, y'all just joking and all that stuff. It's gonna help you get through it. And even when you get out, you still have all those memories with all those people that you've met and no one can ever take any of that away from y'all, all the things that y'all go through together. And I know a lot of people, you know, at home might not have, you know, that might not have all the friends, you know, they wanna have or the people surrounding them that they want, you know, to be surrounded by. And here in the Marine Corps, you are gonna have somebody with you that you can connect with and it's it's a great feeling you know having all these people here that have your back you know ultimately will potentially die for you if the day comes to where they need to and i i would say it, it's an awesome feeling to be part of a organization and like i said the brotherhood of something so great well guys i hope hopefully this kind of cleared up like why should you join the marine corps why kind of like we are the best now i'm not saying that it is all rainbows and you know sunshine and peaches and cream trust me there are days there are days i dread getting up going to work and i believe that's part of any job so that's why i also harp on you know making sure you pick the right job in the marine corps the marine corps itself cool it's an awesome job but you need to make sure your job within the Marine Corps is a job that you want to be stuck with with however long you sign that contract for. And if you kind of need any help doing that, I'm going to leave a card, a tag somewhere up here. Uh, go check out my one of my latest videos of how to choose an MOS or you know the top five uh, jobs I believe are in the Marine Corps. Go check that out if you need help kind of you know guiding you along how to choose a job. But the Marine Corps, I would say, is a great place. It's done me well these past three years and. I'm ready, you know, to carry on my journey and to take 
into the, the rest of my life the skills I've learned here guys but make sure you are hitting that subscribe button guys we are growing every single day and it is awesome to see the growth that y'all are bringing to this channel guys also give the video a thumbs up make sure you leave some comments down below letting me know how I'm doing guys and what videos y'all want to see and guys I missed you I was in the field give me some love guys leave leave some love down in the comments down below guys but as always guys thanks for watching